Okey, bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning and hello everyone. Okey, how are you? I hope that you all are doing fine. Have you had your breakfast yet? I'm sure it is a very tasty dish in the morning. Okey, now for today we will continue learning about colors. Okey. In previous class, we have learned about primary and secondary colors. What are primary colors? They are red, blue, and yellow. Okay? If you need to recap about it, you can watch the video that I posted previously. Okay, today we will continue by learning still about colors, but we will relate it to phonics. Ah, okay. It's been a long time since we have recapped about phonics. Today, we will do that. Before we start, let's look at today's content standard and learning standard. Next, we'll look at the objectives and the success criteria. Okay, okay, before we start about the phonics, let's recap about the colors, okay? What we will do now is I will click at the numbers, a color will come out and you need to match the name and the colors, okay? Box number one. Hmm, what is that? White. Good. Now, which box shows the color white? Okay, good. Box number B. Let's look at box two. Purple. Okay, which box is purple. Okay, good job. Now, let's do number three. Black. Which box is the color black? Okay, good job. Now, let's do box number four. Pink. Which box has the color pink? B. You are correct. Number five. Brown. Which box has the color brown? Box C. Good. Next, number six. Which box has the color blue? Okay, great. Now, number seven. Which box has the color green? Okay, you are doing so good so far. Number eight. Hmm. Which box has the color orange? Okay, D. And number nine. Red. Which box has the color red? C. And last but not least, number ten. Which box has the color yellow? Okay, the answer is A. Congratulations! You managed to get all 10 colors correctly. Okay, now, like what I've mentioned earlier, 
we will learn about colors and phonics. Since we all have refreshed up with the colors, let's look at the colors and phonics. Okay, these are the colors that we have done in the earlier activity. But I add on another color, which is gray. Okay, gray is a type of secondary color where you mix black and white together and you will get the color gray. All right, now we will look at the relations of phonics and colors. Here's what we will learn how to separate the different sounds of the individual letters and combine them into a full word. Okay? okay so look at the color. What color is this? Okay, good. It is red. How do we come up with the sound or word red? It's separated into these three phonemes. First one, R. Eh. D. We combine them all together. It will become red, red, red. Okay, let's look at the second color. What color is this? Good, it is the color blue. How to separate blue into individual sounds? Starts with this. B. B. L. L. N. U. U. You combine all these three together to create the sound blue. Okay? Let's look at number three. Yellow. Okay, this is the color yellow. Yellow are divided into four different sounds. First one is yeah, yeah, eh, eh, l, l, o, o. You combine them all together, it will become yellow. Okay, good. Let's look at color number four. What color is this? Good. This is white. Okay, white is divided into three different sounds. W. I what I combine them all together it will produce the sound or the word white next purple good okay this is the color purple how to pronounce the word purple? It comes from these different sounds. Okay? P for the letter P. Although it is the letter U-R, it is sounded like a er, E-R. Okay? Again, letter P, P. Although the spelling says L-E, the sound it makes are E-L. Okay, so P, A, P. 
ปิลพะเปิลพะเออพะเอลพะเปิลโอเค next we look at this color what color is this this is green good green also divided into four sounds the first one is g g okay this letter r r r okay this Two e e make it longer, not a short e, but a long e e. And then the last letter n n n. So you combine them all together, it become green green. Okay. Next one, orange. Orange comes from three different sounds. Okay, the word orange comes from three different sounds. The first one is using these two letter O and R. It becomes O A and N becomes rain in. G and E become J. J. So you combine them all together, it becomes orange. Orange. Just like the fruit. Okay, orange. Next, brown. Good. Some of you might say this is the color chocolate. Okay. Uh, or cocoa, uh, chocolate and cocoa are different. Cocoa is a type of fruit that, when it's processed, it becomes the chocolate, the food that you like to eat. Okay, but the color is brown. Okay, brown comes from three different sounds. The first one is bur. From the letter B R here, B. Then this let two letters O W, O, O, and the last letter N becomes N. N. You combine them together, it becomes brown. Okay. Next one. What color is this? Yes, it is black. Okay, black. How to divide black into different sounds? It's divided into three different sounds. The first one is bl, bl. Then the letter A, ah. And the two letters here, C and K. Nah, might sound a bit weird, but when you combine it together, it will become black. Black. Okay. Next one, pink. Okay, pink comes from individual letter sounds. Okay, like what we have learned previously up top, it all either combining two letters to produce a sound, or individual letter with its individual sounds. But pink has its own way to arrange it. So p, e, n, k. N, k, pink. Uh, that's how the word pink is formed. Okay. Next, we look at the last and newest color that we learned for today. 
gray. Okay, say it again. Gray. One more time. Gray. Okay, good. Gray, like I've told earlier, it's a combination of the color black and white. You mix those two colors together, it will produce the color gray. Okay, how to pronounce gray? It's divided into two different sounds. The first one comes from these two letters, G and R. It's sounded like this. Gr. Gr. And these two letters, E and Y, although it's spelled E-Y, it sounds like the spelling is E-I. A. A. So you combine these two sounds together, it becomes the color gray. Okay, good. Now, let's practice saying all these colors with the correct sounds. Let's start from number one. Okay, I will point using my cursor here to the colors and you will say the color out loud. Okay? Okay, number one. Red. Number two, blue. Number three, yellow. Number four, white. Number five, purple. Number six, green. Number seven, orange. Number eight, brown number nine black number ten pink and lastly the newest color gray okay good job everyone now we have learned about the sounds let's do a simple activity Okay, the activity that we are doing now is almost the same like the one that we did earlier but now I want you to identify uh, the first letter sounds. Okay, I will give you an alphabet. Then there are color options. You need to match which color that starts with the first letter sound that is given okay let's do it now okay if we look at box now right here it has the p sound okay so which of these colors starts with B, okay, it is pink. Good. Now, number two. Also P, but there are no pink here. So, what is the answer? Good, the answer is A, purple. Purple. Number three. Yeah. Yeah. Green, no. Yellow, no. Yellow, no. Yellow, yes. Okay. Let's look at number four. B, b, pink, orange, red, black, brown. <laughs> okay, got you there. Now, number five. O. Which of these colors starts with the sound O? Oh. Orange. Okay. Let's look at number six. Another B. Mm. Black. Okay. You are correct. 
Number seven. W. Which of these colors starts with the sound W? White. Okay, good. Number eight. Which of these colors starts with the sound R? R. Red. Good. We got two more questions. Number nine. B. Which of these colors starts with the sound B? Okay, good. It's A. Blue. Last question. Number ten. Which of these colors starts with the sound G? Green. Okay, good job. Let's see. Did you have all correct answers? Congratulations. You have all answers correct. Okay. Good job, everyone. Okay, now. I'll explain about our activity for today. You will receive this worksheet. Okay, you need to write your name and your class up top first. And after you finish writing your name and the class, okay, the instructions are read and color the objects. Okay, I have given you some flowers. Okay, these are a bit only. Okay, they, like this. The first flower is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. And there are more you need to color. Color these flowers based on the colors given to them. Okay, like the first one, it says red. So, the flower must be red in color. And number two, orange. You need to color the flower in orange color, yellow, and so on. Okay? That is all for today's lesson. I hope that you learn a lot for today. Thank you. And I shall see you again in the next class. Bye.